Oh my goodness, okay. It's 1133. Uh, I, because my son's getting home from school soon, so I was just checking the time. I was getting close to that. Just finished listening to a voicemail from my dad and talking about Ormus Gold and all this. Okay, so getting getting it out of the wild water. Okay, but anyway, as soon as I clicked off of that, it was 11:33, and I want to show you guys. Oh my goodness, <laughs> this is a. I just noticed it because I was just fidgeting with it. I knew there was. Okay, so there's all kinds of images in this, but I don't know if you can see here. Let me put it back the way it was. Now, I'll turn the light on too. But what do you see? What does that look like? Oops. I'm trying to put my hand behind it. I don't know if that's going to help. No. Doesn't that look like a little baby cub creeping out of from behind a rock, and it kind of looks like a little beat down crown, little miniature crown on one of its ears over here, right here, and there's the two eyes, looks like a little cockeyed third eye right there, there's the little nose, okay, there's its face right there, two little ears, boom, boom. this is just a piece of metal that was eroded with oxide on it, it's like the little baby lion, Leo, right, creeping out on his own now, like, venturing out into the great unknown, and look how, how much of a presence it has, though, just as a baby cub, look how big it is compared to that mountain, and also, like, the sides of it look like kind of forest behind it, now I'm going to turn the light on, see if we can, uh, no, see if we can see it better. See what I'm talking about? Kind of looks like a little crown over here. Boom, boom. There's the eyes, the nose, the little ears. There's the ridge, top of the head right there. Little hill, little mountain here. These kind of little pieces on the side kind of look like forest behind it a little bit. <laughs> So I just thought I would share that with you guys because I knew there was, yeah, I could probably use that for divination, like scrying. <laughs> you could use anything, but, um, and you don't need anything uh, either. So you can just talk to God, but this is the stuff that makes it fun and whimsical and magical and of the earth and tangible and, you know, God gave us tangibility too, so. I just thought that was magical. I wanted to share it with you guys. I hope you guys could see the little baby cub face there. So I love you all. Peace and blessings.